Adam, another good run today. How did it go? Um, yeah, uh, not quite as sweet as yesterday. Um, had to hang on a little bit um, just to save it. Uh, picked up a couple of touches which um, just required a good refocus and I just took it steady from there on just to make sure nothing else went too wrong and uh, yeah, I'm kind of middle of the pack in the final which is quite a good place to be. You had an exceptionally quick run uh, yesterday. How are you finding the course? Uh, yeah, I really enjoy paddling here. Um, it's got a more natural feel to it to what I'm used to in Lee Valley and uh, just makes a nice change. Um, I think I run the boat quite well on flatter courses, so yeah, I'm really enjoying paddling here. You seem to be going uh, exceptionally quickly at the moment. Had you not picked up the four penalty points, then uh, maybe well, you definitely would have been right up there at the top. Um, what do you put your form down to? Um, a number of things, really. Um, I think a bit over winter, I kind of went back a bit to uh, working on stuff that um, I was doing when I was younger. Um, started working with a new coach, uh, Mark Domenjo, and uh, I think it was kind of quite a good time for me to have a change, um, just things a bit different, and uh, yeah, uh, just really enjoying this new, uh, new run of form I'm finding. You obviously have a world champion in the camp uh, with David. How much of an influence does he have over your paddling, and how much advice do you get from him? Uh, yeah, obviously it's great having uh, David around at Lee Valley. Um, our centre is super professional there. Um, and obviously, yeah, I guess when you've got someone like that kind of trained so hard, it's, it's quite inspiring for his younger guys to just kind of see what it's going to take if we want to kind of challenge him, but also get to the top. And I guess we know if we are challenging him, then we're probably setting ourselves in good stead internationally as well. Who do you think are going to be the main contenders in the final other than yourself? Um, well, uh, first of all, it's a massive shame for uh, Sebastian Rossi, obviously kind of medal contender coming into this race, breaks the paddle at the start, um, super inspiring to see him finish, um, kind of a good for Efros guys in the final, um, but I think it won't quite be the same final without him, but I'd say yeah, Roberto Collins and Gary uh, won this race twice, he's got to be uh, the man to beat I think. Well, congratulations on qualifying for the final and we look forward to seeing you at the weekend. Thanks very much.